here at the world premiere of the Volkswagen ID GTI concept in Munich just before IAA beautiful looking car and the Minta designers on the actual far side of the car there so you can start to see some of the GTI branding and uh, the red lines that in splitter at the front do not step on it gorgeous looking uh, and real silhouetting LED lights in it. Now it is a concept we are going to be getting at some stage. It's 4.1 meters long, it's got a wheelbase of 2.6, a width of 1.8 and a height of 1.55. So lovely proportions, traditional GTI kind of a shape, very much a Volkswagen silhouette. So short stubby bonnet, really really nice we haven't got a lot of detail on this car at the moment but we have what we do know they're sitting on 20 inch rims and you can start to see with those alloy wheels harking back to elements of all the different marks of gti over the years small little wing mirror door mirror you've got your glass house effect with your body color roof and door with the glass black b pillar so you're going to start to see volt elements of all different types of volkswagen going down through it your shark fin area at the top your real gti spoiler at the back with that bit of the side lovely really really nice gti rear end in it with your 3d your gti badging now as i said it is a very aggressive diffuser in underneath at the back as well with the high level brake lamp so it is concepty, there are, but there are stuff in it. Boot, you're talking 370 litres. There is some space in underneath the back seat as well of 50 litres. So practicality is going to be in, involved. Like all of the GTI Golfs that have been in the past, it, it can be a family car during the weekend. If you want to put the shoe down at the weekends, this is the car that you can do it in. Change of designing the likes of the ID3. This is more traditional to what we're used to with regards to Volkswagen. You can start to see that that Andy Mint, who's over there, the designer, is really leading the charge with this. And we saw this originally with the ID2 um, in when it was released in Hamburg in March. So six months on, now we're starting to see what the actual GTI is going to look like. Now, in that ID2 original car, you could see elements of that GTI ness coming through. There's Andy, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, and you can see the badging down along here with that red line on it. There's Andy letting me in to do some filming, so I really appreciate it. So lots of really nice, and it's all about, this conference is called Success by Design, and it's all about how Volkswagen are gonna stand out from the crowd with that iconic design language across all of the different brands that sit within that Volkswagen group. I really like it. I never owned a Golf GTI. I've never owned a Golf. I owned a Volkswagen Caddy. So this is something that I don't know, but it's perfect for the likes of me. It's only myself, my partner and the dog. I don't need big SUVs and more of these hatchbacks is what we actually want on the roads. Hopefully you enjoyed that first look of the Golf GTI, ID GTI concept. Make sure you've liked the video, hit the subscribe button, jump into the comments and let me know what you think. And remember, if you think an EV is for you, leave it to me and I'll review. Thank you very much for watching.